Fortnite has just officially teased Season 5 in-game, and we also have a brand new teaser trailer for Season 5 to show you guys in today's video, as well as new Battle Pass skins. You do not want to go anywhere, because wow, this next season is absolutely insane. And remember, if you guys do want one of the brand new Fortnite Mare skins for completely free, I still gift 5 subscribers every single day. To people who leave a like on the video, hit that big red subscribe button, and leave a comment with your epic ID name in the comment section below. And a huge shout out to all of the legends putting in code Apple One in the item shop. I appreciate it a ton. Wait, we've got a kid. Oh, we do. Hello, my friend. Wait. Bro, this, this, bro, this lobby's laggy. Hello? Where did he go? Oh, he downed himself. We got a chrome punk skin. Oh, mate, this lag is horrendous, bro. What was that? Starting off topic though, November's crew pack has actually already accidentally been decrypted in the files, being this dragon looking skin, which I think actually looks super, super sick. And it also has the legacy styles, which I honestly really, really like. This will be available two days before season five's launch. And by then the teasers will be absolutely insane, but we already have some teasers in game with the time machine showing the 12th of July, 2018, which is the chapter one season five launch date. And around the map of Frenzy Fields, you may have actually noticed some interesting props have actually shown up. And this is due to the first time corruption. It has teleported four iconic landmarks coming from the tomato head from Tomato Town from the Chapter 1 Island, the Season 5 Der Burger, which we actually did see in the Season 5 trailer and also in real life, the Dusty Diner sign, which was in the lobby and in the desert biome, as well as the Truck Stop sign, which was also in the desert biome. This is an absolutely huge teaser for next season. It looks like next season, we're also going to be getting a brand new desert biome, which we're going to be talking about a bit later on. But if you did pay attention over here, the time machine is also there showing the date of season 5 chapter 1's launch date which is now confirmed to be returning for season 5. We are going back to the chapter 1 map but not fully 20% of this map will be integrated to it next season with some POIs which I really hope we do get Mega City because we do have Tilted Towers confirmed to be coming next season so two popular city POIs would be absolutely insane but it also means we're going to be getting Pleasant Park and Salty Springs return next season which bro I am so so excited for and like I just said the desert biome will be returning due to the desert props now on the island. You guys can actually see the desert in outer space when you guys are waiting to go into a game. You guys can also see it teased in this loading screen all the way from chapter 4 season 1. So they've been teasing the desert biome for a very, very long time. And they've also been updating the desert trees from chapter 1 in the files for a long time as well. And that all makes sense now. Hence, we're going back to chapter 1 season 5, bro. It's going to be absolutely insane, but it doesn't stop there. Fortnite themselves on Twitter have actually changed their location to the 12th of July 2018, which is the chapter 1 season 5 launch date like I've just said many times, which does confirm they are teasing the return, but some of you may be wondering how we're going to get there. The time machine will start failing like it's already started to fail, causing this time corruption, but a massive time corruption will happen, pulling us through a rift into the past, which is going to be absolutely amazing for the cinematic trailer for season 5, but Ferrells has actually already made a teaser trailer of what it actually could look like. Right, I don't know how I'm going to challenge this on 300 ping, bro. Bro, this lobby is... Ho what are wrong with the servers, bro? Oh, hello. Bro, what? What? He's just... Oh, my God, bro. This kid is a bot, like, but... Bro, it should not take me a whole mag. Oh, here's a kid. Bro, what is that? Mate. This is awful, bro. Oh, my days. But did you know we already have our first Season 5 skin in the files right now? Being the Heartbreak Ranger skin, the Inferno Jonesy, which looks absolutely insane. And this will actually be next season's starter pack skin. And I can't lie, bro, this skin looks really, really sick. The bat blink's awesome and also the pickaxe is pretty cool. I can't wait for Season 5. The skins are, look absolutely amazing. They've kind of got like that old texture feel to them. They look super cool. But now it's time to talk about the Season 5 of Battle Pass. This won't be a normal Battle Pass. It will be much 
much easier to unlock as we only have one month to do so and it will be just like a season X's with popular skins getting recreated as we are going back in time starting with this new kit skin it's currently the second most popular survey skin in the surveys and I mean I think it looks pretty cool bro it's kit in like some sort of mech suit I think the skin does look really really amazing let me know in the comments if you guys would like to see this skin we then have a galaxy jonesy skin in these surveys which I think will be the best skin in here honestly let me know in the comment section below honest opinions on this skin I think it looks amazing it's mixed with jonesy and a galaxy skin bro there's nothing you can't like about it but agent jones will be getting a brand new seven suit next season as well he's going to be called the legend and he's going to be the main skin in next season's battle pass which looks absolutely amazing let me know in the comment section below what you guys do think about both of these skins but we then have this new unicorn armored bright bomber skin as we all know this is fortnite's face skin everyone has it and it is very well known to everyone around the world that this bright bomber skin is fortnite skin and it makes a lot of sense for them to recreate this skin because honestly i would love to see this skin in game but we also do have this llama skin llamas are fortnite's mascot they are so loved by everyone and everyone wants a llama skin in the game we did get the crew pack llama skin but that was kind of poo i'm not gonna lie i didn't really like the skin but to see this one in the next season's battle pass i would absolutely love it looks absolutely amazing i probably rock it quite a lot i don't usually use battle pass skins that often but this skin i honestly think would be really really cool we then have this brand new robot rex skin fortnite's very first dinosaur skin was the rex skin and it was extremely extremely popular and it was extremely hyped as well and this would make a lot of sense and i would rock this skin to the moon bro it kind of reminds me of like a mech rex skin i think it'd be pretty amazing let me know in the comment section below what you guys do think about some of these survey skins because honestly they do look really really cool but we also have these two skins which are actually some of fortnite's most popular skins ever coming from fish sticks and the tomato head skin but they're actually in like this new metal style which actually could be a new bundle next season which i would absolutely love to see let me know in the comment section below if you guys would like to see a metal fish sticks and a metal tomato head skin bundle in the game oh we got got a kid okay apparently that hit him for 21 yeah what oh uh, uh, bro I, i'm uh i i don't even know what to say but we could also finally be getting the Moss Legends bundle. This was leaked two years ago, coming with the Moss Knight skin, the Moss Bright Bomber skin, and the Moss Omega skin, all coming with their very own batlings and pickaxes. And my designer, EA Skate Concepts, has redesigned what they actually could look like in-game. If you guys had to pick one of these skins to come out, I'm definitely going to be picking the Moss Knight skin. But you'll be glad to know this is going to be a brand new bundle. And we actually have seen these in the game before, in the Destiny trailer, which does confirm they are on the way, but it's just been a very very long wait okay at least that works bro, bro what wait shoot the thing bro i bro oh my i don't even know what's happening bro i i wonder if this bro what Bro, I can't do anything. This connection is horrendous. I'm going to die. Oh my days. Bro, I can't move! But that is everything we have for you guys in today's video. My connection this video has been horrendous. I don't even know what's happening. I'm going to go sort it out right now. I'm lagging in the lobby, bro no idea season five is going to be absolutely insane let me know in the comment section below if you guys are excited and i'll see you guys in my next video peace